but we've made our MP4 cinema graph. Um, we're now going to uh, bring it onto the internet, and this process will work whether you're going to use a standard HTML, CSS web page, or it'll work um, if you want to embed in WordPress. We have a dummy site on uh, ASCJportfolio.org that we use for training. It's called creative.ASCJportfolio.org. And um, as you can see, I, I pulled a few articles from the New York Times the other day. I'm going to show you how to make a post and then embed the cinema graph that we made that was M, uh, MP4. So I'm going to go to Post, Add New. And I'm going to call this thing Cinema Graph. Or better yet, rather than calling the cinema graph, we can just call it USC Fountain. And then we're going to hit Add Media. Okay. With Add Media, we're now going to select the file that we made. In this case, it was Fountain Ready for Web MP4. I'm just going to take it and drag it in. Now, here's where things get a little bit tricky. Uh, you do not want it to embed the media player. So what we're going to do is just hit uh, link to media file and that's fine. Okay. Now what it's done is it's just created a simple link to where the file is on, on the server. So what we're going to do is actually just copy the exact location or URL of it. And then we're going to use uh, the video tag. Let's see what happens. There we go. That looks about right. Now we should do exactly what the the file itself is for 96540. Yeah, that's a, that's correct. 96540, and there's my width. There we go. So if we look at the visual text, we can put some uh, some text around here and say USC Fountain. This is the fountain at USC. And there it is. Preview. So now the last thing to do is hit publish. It'll think about it. Now we have a link. And if we just view the post, it's completely published and available to show to the entire world. Thanks for watching.